Hey guys, welcome to my page. This is Audio Monkey, and today I'm gonna to be showing you this cool VST called Melodyne. Um, if you're new here, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications bell. I drop cool tutorial videos and Afrobeats videos. So without wasting time, guys, I'm gonna jump right into this video. So today I'm gonna to be showing you this VST called Melodyne. Really powerful VST, really good. And originally, this is a VST that a lot of sound engineers and music producers use for vocals. They use it for pitch correction of vocals, but it also has a lot of additional features. And one additional feature particularly that I am really interested in, and I'm actually gonna show you guys today. So um, basically, Melodyne can analyze audio files, like sample files, and it has the ability to like analyze the harmonic um, content of the audio and it'll actually show you the chords in the audio file and you can export those chords in MIDI and reuse them in your own way. And this is a really helpful tool because many times we have samples on our, in our library that we like, we might not have the MIDI data, but we just like the chord progression. and it might be a bit difficult at times to score those sounds and get the exact data, the correct you know, melodies and the correct notes and all that. So this is where Melodyne comes in and it's really helpful, really powerful and surprisingly really accurate too. So without wasting time, guys, I'm going to show you exactly how this thing works and how you can start using it with your production right away. So I have um, this um, random sample right here. And I'm just going to drag it to my playlist. Um, it's in, this is it's 110 BPM, so I'm just going to adjust my tempo to that. And I'm going to send this to the first mixer track, because that's where I have my Melodyne. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use Melodyne to analyze this audio file, right? And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see how effective Melodyne is with um basically like you know detecting the chords and all that so sorry i'm just going to reload it real quick and um yeah so now um let's do that let's do that so i'm going to turn this button on which is like the record button and i'm going to press play and So guys, we've recorded the audio into Melodyne and Melodyne in seconds has detected, you know, the notes playing in this audio. And it's just like the FL Studio, you know, piano roll. You have, you have all the individual notes and you just come here to settings, right? And you can save as MIDI. And I'm just going to choose to save it on my desktop and I'm going to press save. So now that I've done that, I'm going to mute this real quick. I'm going to add a new pattern. And I'm going to add a VST instrument. Let's see. I'm going to add um, purity. Let's go find something. Uh, okay, let me see. Bell. Yeah, let me use a marimba. Okay, perfect. So um, I'm going to go to Piano Row. I'm going to go here, File, Import MIDI File. And, you know, I saved the data on my desktop. So I'm just going to desktop and I'm going to press Open. So voila, we have this. So guys, as you can see, it's 100% accurate. Like I'm going to play with the original sample so you guys can see for yourself. Oh 
So guys, that's it. That's it. That's Melodyne. And that is how you can use Melodyne to analyze your samples and get the MIDI information, like the MIDI data, and reuse them in your own productions. So I hope you found this video helpful. Um, if you like this video, like it, drop some comments, and subscribe. Share with your friends, people that might find this content useful. Share it to them. And that's it for this video, guys. Stay safe and keep it locked. Till we meet again, guys. Peace.